My move to Sunset Cove should have brought a life of change. But since arriving in this wacko place, I find myself involved with aliens caught in a spider's web. <laughs> what it takes to beat me? You worm, you don't stand a chance. You won! And me, new editor of the school website, caught in a web of intrigue. Hey, you, Mr. Editor. I personally recounted all the votes and 1,976 people voted for me. But there's only um, the 451 people in the whole of the school. Yes, right. So where did the 2,324 people that voted for you come from? I, d I don't know what you mean. I mean, <laughs> it can happen. I am so buggin'. You cheat, you lab rodent, you total Melvin. What, what, what are you saying? I am like a hundred times way more popular than you. So if it was really democratic, every vote for me would have counted a hundred times. You robbed me. I don't know how you did it, but you did! Sabrina! Hi. Nice to see you taking it so well. I will get even with you. I'll fix you, Giles Gordon. Mm. Could it be you have an enemy for life? Maybe longer. What do you say? Well, I know there's something funny about this whole election thing. Yeah, you won it. Come on, Giles. You don't think there was a conspiracy behind it, do you? You've done well, Octavia. Giles is editor. He'll be our eyes and ears of the school. We'll know everything, thanks to you. How could it have been a fix? I mean, Octavia nominated me, and Octavia would never be involved with anything that wasn't totally squeaky clean. The mysterious signals have stopped. Has that got anything to do with your father? Why don't you call and ask him? Thank you, Octavia. What a brilliant idea. Only kidding, naturally. We have to find out if he's made contact with the alien forces. It's time for you to have a party. A party? The party will create the perfect diversion while we carry out a deep search of the house. But I don't know how to have a party. Relax. Go with the flow. You'll love it. A party? Oh, yes, of course, sweetie pie, of course you can. Oh, you're gonna have the best party a girl ever had, honey bunny. Thank you, Mommy. They had the best party ideas on Sharp Therapy TV the other day. You'd be amazed. But if I told you, that'd spoil it. Major Downer, the signals have stopped. What does that mean? What does it mean when the drums stop beating? Our baby girl's having a party, dear. No, it doesn't. It means they're ready, out there watching and waiting, ready to attack. I want heat-activated mines outside the kitchen. I want frogmen in the goldfish pool. I want those laser whoopee alarms. See to it. I want a secure perimeter. You'd never guess there were so many ways of cooking roadkill raccoon. I got the tail again. Stop whining, you got the nose too. A party? Kids? Teenagers? <laughs> Are we talking major overtime here? Plus a major bonus per smile. Well, do you want some of the teeth all of the time? Or all of the teeth some of the time. Oh, oh you tease. Well, that's settled. <laughs> Are you going to eat that tail? You want to arm wrestle for it? <laughs> I didn't think so. Set to receive on all transmission bands. Call me if you can. Oh, bye.
lies a great egg of Fenor. I swear to you, Vortex, Nebula, and Zeron, that as long as the Fenor gather together in their hot mud tubs beneath the triple suns of home, your songs of heroism will echo. <laughs> I salute you wherever you are. It is. It's him. Get away. No, 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 it's us. We're here. Get away from me. Ah. What's a party? It's when you go to someone's house and they play cool music and everyone has a fun time and chicks meet guys, you know, and... Chicks? Like you? Me? Why me? Uh, nothing. Well, maybe me. Well, anyway, he might say to her, Hey, Patoo, do you want to cut a rug? Yeah. What next? Wait, wait. Well, then, she might say... I'm buzzing, cousin. Tell my shoes the news. And then they dance. They dance? Oh, it's the thing you do to music. <laughs> what about the rug? What? God, tell him, Giles, man. You can't stare at her like that. What? Huh? Tavia? No. Are you kidding? Like he wanted her to throw you a stick to fetch. What the? I was not. Listen, there's something about Octavia. If you feel the way you look, you gotta be careful. She, she's different. She's. Look, not another crazy theory, Jim. <sighs> Maybe I'll uh, surprise everybody at the party. What? By getting smart? Hey, do you guys know where I can get some sheep? What do you want sheep for? Fancy dress, of course. I'm going as Bo Peep. <laughs> I shouldn't even be thinking about going. I'm not looking for anybody else. It'd be unfaithful to Anthony's memory. I think I'll dig out my old Tarzan costume. Oh. Oh, I forgot. Shrunk in the wash. Ah! Oh. No, no. Wear it anyway. Please. I could be... Jane. What about the chimp? Hey, Octavia. Party girl? Well, I'll be there for sure. Just for you. What? I get it, babe. Play it cool in front of all the others. But, uh, we both know where you're coming from. Plunging into parallel universes at will through quantum rifts and time-space fluidity factors. Or maybe I should wear this dress with these shoes. Or maybe a bag over your head? What's she doing? Look, you gotta understand that Sabrina is just a tiny cog in a machine that is designed to totally ruin our taste and wreck our minds. And these factors will result in the end of life as we know it, unless we all do one simple thing, which is... Whatever you wear, make sure it doesn't clash with mine. Mr. Dorsey. Yes, Octavia, what can I do for you? I'm having a party Saturday, and I wondered if you'd like to come. Me? A party? Oh, thank you. Fancy dress is optional. What does that mean, exactly? Or you could come as you are. Really? Uh, you mean, as, as I really am? Is that what you mean? They say fancy dress can express the inner you. Do they? Hmm. Well, it's a good idea. And it would be a great relief, Octavia, to be myself for once. <laughs> Careful with that hammer, soldier. Use the rubber one. Sir, yes, sir! And don't try this at home. Major Dawson, I want ground controls up. I want this perimeter secure. And I don't mean with hair bands. Tell your men to keep these invitations with them at all times. 
You know your mission. Infiltrate the house as guests in fancy dress. Search everything and everywhere. Oh, and make sure you bring back some of Commander Vermont's clothes. I want them for forensic and DNA testing. Hey! Hey, Beanie, where'd you go? She went hunting for a soda. I think she might just catch one, too. Wow! Oh, this is so beautiful. Look at all of this. David, you're so clever. Who are these people? What are they doing here? Daddy, these are my friends. I'm having a party, remember? A party? When? Hello, everyone, and welcome to Octavia's special party. First off, there'll be some games and some entertainment and prizes. Thank you all for coming, and please enjoy yourselves. Hi, Giles. You want to whatever these are? Mom, what are you wearing? You're embarrassed. Well, what do you think of me? This is totally weird. Everything's like for children. What do I care? I'm so upset about Anthony. I, I shouldn't have come. All these guys hitting on me. I bet Octavia's gonna have like a surprise party where no one actually knows it is a party. And suddenly it is and everybody jumps out. Jumps out of what? This is a real surprise party because it's actually at a party. There is a party and then there is a party. I don't get it. Bonehead. Octavia. Mr. Dorsey, is that you? Wow, terrific costume. I'm sorry I'm a bit late, but here I am, come as you are. And such beautiful flowers. Ah. Thank you. This is my mother. Y your costume, it, it looks so real. So does yours. <laughs> yeah, I thought I heard someone scream. Daddy, this is Mr. Dorsey, my science teacher. Whoa, 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 whoa! Pleased to meet you. you from somewhere. It's like... I'm Mr. Dorsey from Atlantis High, and you are Giles's mother. Mr. Dorsey, great costume. Don't let me keep you from your carpentry. You know, it's bizarre, but I just can't help this feeling that we've met before, not at school, but exactly like this. Deja vu, perhaps. <clears throat> Would you care to dance? Oh, I'm working. But, um, catch me later, alligator. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Who are those guys? Who's that? Hey, come on if you want. Where? Who? Oh, me. Yeah, yeah. Hey, come on if you want. Um, there were the, uh, the ninja guys around the place. But Giles, this is fancy dress. 
But they're friends of Octavius, of course. They've got invitations. Who else could they possibly be? <laughs> but who's the weird dame looking for her sheep all over the place? about this party, and the guests didn't appear to be exactly who they seemed. <gasps> you like my dress? I chose it especially. You think it suits me? <laughs> Here, have a closer look. of my girlish heart. How can you torment me like this? Oh! Come on, good Shane. It's moments like these that a woman needs to be alone. Right, Violet? with vitalizing vitamins and energizing electrons. They're burning! Fire! Fire! Help! Fire! Fire! Looks like a job for the silver lining. How secure is the perimeter? Give the sentries a loyalty donut. Vermont, out. Carry on, men. My clothes! My, my costume! Shucks, Miss Jet. If you ain't the purtiest girl in the whole dang hoedown. On the what? Woods there care to trip the light fantastic? I mean, are you okay? Hey, Patootie, wanna cut a rug? Well, in that case, I'm buzzing, cuz I give my shoes the news. Did it work? It did for me. Octavia. We thought you were kind of cool, but this is so chronic. 
way so ridiculous. Thank you for nothing because that's so what it was. Well, I'm staying because I think the party's really great. Akili! Come back here, you naughty little sheep. It's all ruined. My life's such a mess. And I didn't even want to have a party in the first place. Um, then, uh, why did you? It's all too complicated to explain. Well, you know, I mean, well, well look at them, you know. The people that matter are having a, a great time. Are they? Yeah, the way to go, Vanny. What about you? Uh, no, no. Okay, um, well, <laughs> just standing here, you know, you and me, I mean, that's a, that's a great time for me. <laughs> Why, what, what's the matter? What is it? Come on, I want to tell you something. <laughs> I'll just get a jacket. <laughs> so these are um, all yours? <laughs> They're not the old music prizes and the exams in the Olympic polo team and, and it's all around the world yacht race and the old um, Pulitzer Prize? <laughs> yes. Well? I mean, I don't understand. I mean, if you've done all of this, then why are you still... At high school? Please, please don't ask me that. Not now. It's too complicated. Come on, let's go up on the roof. Oh, beautiful cake. Someone has to eat the last slice. Count me out. Whenever I eat cake, my uniform shrinks two sizes. Dorothy! Me? You kidding? You have it. I'm stuffed. I know. I'll send her to Aunt May out west. Have an anime out west too. No, just one out west. And is she crazy for Kay? <laughs> is she ever? How did you guess? There. I'll post it tomorrow. I want you to promise me you won't tell anyone about what you saw in my room. Will you do that? Yeah, sure. I, I, I promise. Yeah, but what's wrong? I mean, I mean, you tell me I'm. I'm here. Well, what do our problems matter when you see all those stars? And whoever's out there, they're looking at them too and thinking that exact same thing. What would they be like if we meet them face to face? Giles, I'm not who you think I am. Yeah, you're even better. <laughs> with Josh or Octavia or the ninjas or Mr. Dorsey. He won first place for the fancy dress. But there was something more to this party. And I was determined to find out exactly what. <laughs> <laughs> 